Hello viewers, today we are going to learn how to manipulate in Photoshop or how to place a simple model in this background or how to match the color of this image. So let's begin our tutorial. This is our background image and this is our model image and we are and we are going to put this model in this background. So what we have to do this just first take a new document by clicking this this one the size make resolution 300 and click on create or you can name this one just design name this one as a poster then create the poster document is ready and now we are going to place our background image first so this is our background and we are just drag and drop and simply Resize your image by holding shift and alt key and zoom your image by pressing ctrl plus and zoom out your image by controlling minus ctrl and minus then just simply arrange this one as per your background press ok Resize this one and just I think this one is perfect. And now we are going to add more extra image from this blank area. So, what you do, just click on rectangle marker tool and select this area and simply go to edit and go to content fill away. We just see the result, but the result is not seen here. Then press OK. So you can see that the work is almost done. Do the same thing in this area. Go to Edit, Fill, and Make Content Aware. Then press OK. Go to Select and Deselect this one. Crop this one and simply make marquee tool or merge this layer and zoom this image. So this one is then now we are going to place our model so this is our model and we are going to first select this one by using pen tool so this one is pen tool and zoom this image by pressing ctrl plus and select start your selection when you complete your selection just press ctrl minus and then right click and go to make selection and make parallelization 0 then press ok your model is selected now we are going to place our model in our background image with background image so just simply drag and drop your image in your workplace so just simply drag and drop this one and we are going to remove this white line so what you have to do just select laser tool and zoom your image to make clear vision and simply select this one these are the small area so we are going to use this tool just delete this one click on move tool and go to selection and make deselect this one zoom out your image by pressing ctrl minus and resize your image just holding shift and alt key The image is placed perfect area. You can see this in your navigator bar. Just zoom your 
image and now we are going to add a little bit shadow so take a blank layer and go to brush and make foreground color black and make opacity this one 100 percent and simply click in this area hold shift key and just make this one little bit this look like a rectangle I think this one is not black so just delete this one select and go to this area or uh, take dark black and then click on this blank area or you can place this one in another area such like in this place I think this one is the best place for your model now we are going to apply some dodge and bust layer or you can use this opacity by using just blank layer and click on brush tool and make this one 50% grey and go to blending mode and set this one in overlay and make this one as a clipping mask create clipping mask then we are going to apply some brush this is uh, make foreground color white color and opacity is 100% is perfect and let's simply use this one this one provide you an amazing glossy look to your model And now going to dodge tool and just apply in that portions This one is done and now again go to burn tool and apply on her his shoes So this one is almost done, make this one 50% and add little bit sport, sporty look. So we just place this football. So this one is football. Now take a blank layer, 
create clipping mask and brush tool and make this one black and just simply add on this football make opacity a little bit decrease but now this one is almost done now we are going to add little bit light behind this model so just click on this area take a blank layer go to brush tool and do the same thing make foreground color white and increase the size of brush by pressing bracket key and simply apply this white shade hold shift to make this arrangement more beautiful So this one is done and make again blank layer take again one more blank layer this one is done brush tool and click or resize the brush and apply this one in that portion and go to blending mode and set this one is overlay you can also make little bit more brighter to make this one to do it and this one is brighter area the work is almost done so we are going to provide a amazing fantasy look so we just take or add a simple bird image so this is our bird image and simply drag and drop this one and make this layer in upper portion or place this layer in upper portion and just simply resize this one and place in that area and place this one in that area now go to filter camera raw and adjust the color of this bird so make this one little bit darker increase the clarity and increase the saturation then press ok the work is almost done and now we are going to arrange the color of complete work so just go to adjustment layer color balance and make this one as a shadow portion make shadow portion a little bit blue and cyan and again go to mid tone and increase the color of mid tone in yellow and make this one a little bit cyan and highlighted area highlighted area is the wider part of this area the wider part part is always make yellow or make this one is little bit blue is blue looks good and cyan then press okay now we are going to mask the complete layer by holding shift control alt plus e and duplicate this one and go to filter make collection and camera raw or color effects pro go to cross process or cross balance and take this one or take any of this effect Uh, you can choose this one and make this one as a increase the saturation brightness little bit higher contrast this one is perfect and soft contrast increase this one shadow portion 60% or 50% highlighted area is perfect and then press okay
this one is almost done and we are going to add some text so just click here and simply add a text so we are going to testing this one is a okay, okay. clear select this one go to your text editing and select any of this text adjust the size of this one So this one is almost done and you can change this color uh, the white is perfect for your work so your work is almost done and take again click on adjustment layer go to gradient and make this one is black then press ok now we are going to add more effect such like make this one duplicate we are going to try this one to make more beautiful then go to filter go to nick collection and color effects pro click on cross processing and this one is look good but not so perfect so just select any of this one i think this one look more better then press ok we see the output result of this one it's look cool now go to again camera row click on fx and just simply minus this one little bit increase the sharpness increase the saturation also because this one is so important shadow area decrease little bit white balance also decrease or this one is make increase and now press ok so your work is done and hope you can understand this tutorial completely and you like this tutorial if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel okay see you soon with a new tutorial okay goodbye